The NFL is on EA Sports, and we are in Silicon Valley at Levi Stadium in Santa Clara. Coming up, a rematch of Super Bowl 54, as it'll be the Kansas City Chiefs taking on the San Francisco 49ers. Here's the kicker, Harrison Butker, ready to get this one started. And we are underway from Santa Clara. And he won't get this to the 20-yard line as he's down at the 19. And the tight end goes in motion left. They start on the ground with McCaffrey up to the 20. Oh, that's a real nice job there by the defensive front. They just engaged and held their ground. But how about the guy who made the play? We often talk about whether they take a good first step or not. Many times you just don't take any step. Just get your feet moving, get your body going. And then once he made the read, he was able to make the play. Purdy now to throw off the play action. Eluding the pressure right. Oh, he had a man open. He overshot him. It's incomplete. Well, I think you have to forgive him just a little bit here because he's out of the pocket trying to make a play. But he rushes this throw and just wings it downfield right over the head of his wide open receiver. An early tough test on the opening drive. This is third and eight. They go play action here, Purdy. He's got his target. That's complete. And they're going to get this beyond the 40 before he's taken down. A well-executed 22-yard gain. Play action, and now here's Purdy to throw it. The first catch of the game for George Kittle. And they'll get this well past midfield before being stopped just before the 35. 22 yards on the catch and run, a first down. Again, it's Purdy to throw it. And looking for Kittle, but it's intercepted. And he will take this one home. It's a touchdown. Well, they were advancing the ball. They had a couple first downs under their belt, but a big mistake there on the opening drive leads to six points the other direction. And what a good read that was on his part, Brandon, because it prevents a possible scoring drive with how they were moving things along. And it gives the defense the early advantage of what's going to be a definitely entertaining battle between these units. So they throw the pick six. They'll get another shot at it now as this one's in the air. And they will not get a chance to return this one. It's through the back of the end zone for a touchback. The 49er offense set to get this drive underway. The drive begins with a run by McCaffrey. And down he goes, but he takes it up to the 40. 15 yards is the pick up there, and the drive starting very nicely. First down. Again, they run. Again, it's McCaffrey. And some nifty running here as he'll take this across midfield and down to the 47. 13 yards there and a Niner first. Consecutive plays now where that offensive line has really created a lot of space. And we've seen the confidence rise, haven't we? It borders on arrogance now, and that's that good arrogance, believing you can run the football whenever you get good and ready. And he'll get this down only to about the 46. Defensively, a solid response after giving up back-to-back -back first downs. Second and nine. Now this time they'll throw it. Here's Purdy. Man open. That's Debo Samuel. And he'll be brought down with a first down as the tackle's made at the Chiefs' 24-yard line. 
A good pick up there, a 22. McCaffrey running up the middle. Trying to run inside, but nothing there. Here's second and 10. This is McCaffrey on the give. And he'll take this close to a first down at the Chiefs 14. Play number seven coming on this drive. It's third of inches. And a find the open man. That's complete. Touchdown for the Niners. Good bounce back drive right there through the pick on drive number one. Drive number two leads them right down the field into the end zone. Agree totally. Excellent bounce back. Tremendous poise. Confidence never lost. And obviously he transmitted that to his teammates as well. What a really nice drive. And that flag accepted. So I'll leave it at seven now as they kick it away. And this will not be returnable. It's out of the back of the end zone for a touchback. Mahomes will lead the Chiefs up first and 10 at their 25-yard line. They'll try and start this drive in the air. And that throw behind his man. He missed him incomplete. Maybe a little over-anxious in the pocket there. He just didn't look comfortable on that throw. No, he didn't because it wasn't his normal fluid delivery. And I think you might have had it right. Wasn't really confident with what he saw downfield and almost felt like he wanted to pull that one back. Mahomes to throw on second down. That's complete. It's Travis Kelsey. And he gets this one just shy of the 40. They'll mark him down at the 39. That goes for a Chiefs first down, 14 yards. Well, the first drive here and the first time that we've called a big tight end's name, but I, I can assure you this, Charles, it, it won't be the last. No, it won't, because when he gets going, now it opens up opportunities on the perimeter because that'll draw the defense towards him in the middle of the field. Now your wide receivers are getting involved as this game goes on. There he goes, left side. And a big game that time. He's out of bounds on what will be the final play of this first quarter. 7-7, seven, seven, our score after one. So again from the 39, this time from the other side of the field. Here's first and 10. Working from the gun, Mahomes. They'll check this one down to Pacheco. So give him two yards there on the completion, and that's going to bring up second down. Here's Mahomes to throw. Complete the tight end, Kelsey. And he's taken down, but not before reaching the 10-yard line. So not quite a first and goal. It's first and 10 from the 10. Looking to throw is Mahomes. Flushed out right. And that's caught. It's Kelsey. Touchdown, Kansas City. Ten yards on the touchdown pass. And the Chiefs have taken the lead. Butker on for the PAT. And he's got it. It's now a 14-7 ball game. Now after the touchdown, here's Butker on to kick it away. The San Francisco offense ready to start their next drive. They trail a one-score deficit, 14-7, as they come up first and 10. Now a throw right side taken in here to start this drive. Down the sideline he goes. Touchdown, Fires! Danny Gray, 79 yards. And the Niners are able to strike quickly here as they are in for six. As a former DB, you might not like to see that, but from a wide receiver's perspective, 
Those are the plays they dream of. Correct on both counts, <laughs> all right? Because once he took off, I mean, let's face it, that should have been done in big sky country. Aren't any speed <laughs> limits out there? And off he went. Glad I wasn't the one trying to chase him. Moody good with the extra point, and we are tied at 14. This one tied at 14 now as he sends this one away. And we see James, he will not return it, and they'll bring it out to the 25. KC offense out of the huddle, ready for their next drive. And right now, we've got a little bit of an offensive masterpiece going on both sides, moving the football, scoring points. It's almost like somebody put the defense on rookie mode in this one. I mean, we haven't even left the first half, Charles, and we're certainly on pace for a shootout. An excellent start for both offenses. The fans have to be enjoying this to see all these points go up on the board. As a former defender, you know I'm not enjoying this at all, but right now, both these teams just trading haymakers. Let's see if anyone slips up first. Can anyone counter with a nice little jab and get things going in their direction? Here's a second and two now from the 33. Pacheco gets it, drives the left side. And forget about finding a lane. He barely had time to look up before he was planted in the backfield. On third down, it's Pacheco. It's celebrating, and off he goes. And he'll take this to the other side of midfield before going out of bounds. 41 yards rushing for him now on just his first three carries. So from inside Niner territory now, this is first and 10 at the 48-yard line. Shotgun snap to Mahomes. The tight end, Kelsey, has it over the middle. He'll get this one down near the 20-yard line, just shy of the 20. 28 yards the gain there on the catch and run. Oh, that was a nice job there. Quarterback and receiver reading the pressure that was brought. They both knew it was going to open up the middle of the field. Nice little shake and bake in the line of scrimmage. Got right into his route, and the quarterback hit him in. And that's caught. It's Kelsey. Touchdown, Kansas City. Travis Kelsey with his second touchdown here in this first half. And the Chiefs have broken our tie as they take the lead. Extra point by Butker is on target. And the lead is now 21-14. Now after the touchdown, here's Butker on to kick it away. And able to get this out to the 25. The 49er offense set to get this drive underway. Well, partner, you know, coaches always say that every play is designed to score a touchdown. Sometimes that's not really true, but last drive, that was the case. One play to get into the end zone, and now they're trying to duplicate that success here. And it's rare for those moments to happen. Incredible when they do. And you saw the celebration. Pure, unbridled joy after that one. So here's a first and 10 at the 38. Purdy now to throw. Again to the big tight end, George Kittle. And he'll go out of bounds, it appears, right at the 45. Second down and three. Play action, now Purdy. Oh, and his early struggles continue. Here's another one intercepted. Trent McDuffie with a pick. And the Chiefs will take over here as they get it up to the 43-yard line. Before we came up to the booth, last thing he said as we were walking off the field, want to play mistake-free football. Well, that just went out the window there with a pick. And do you remember what you said to me when we were walking up to the booth after he said that? You're like, oh, fatal last words. Every time we hear that, 
It's caught inside the 25. They'll get this one down near the 20-yard line, just shy of the 20. Mahomes now on first down. A hit as he throws there, incomplete. I see the surprise in your face there, partner. That is a rare incompletion from him. He's been on point this entire game. He has percentage completion-wise way up. Not that time. On second down, here's Mahomes. And that is incomplete. Oh, he had it and dropped it. That is an unforced error there that takes away what could have been a touchdown. Now it's Mahomes again. And he's got it. Touchdown, Chiefs. Marquez Valdez Scambling bringing in that one for Patrick Mahomes. And the Chiefs go up by two touchdowns. Extra point by Butker is on target. And the lead now up to 14. Now after the touchdown, here's Butker on to kick it away. And that one bounces out of the back of the end zone, so we'll start the drive at the 25 on the touchback. The San Francisco offense ready to start their next drive. But Charles, we'll see what they can do here. Not a ton of time left, but enough certainly to get points out of this drive. And they need them right now because they're trailing. Yeah, and this is exactly why you practice a two-minute drill all through camp and at least one practice each week before a game. A minute left, more than enough time to string a few completions together, reach the end zone, and then make that walk back to the locker room just a little more animated. Oh, they're going to run a little pop pass here. And up to the 35 before they're able to knock him down. And the 49ers now going to use the first of their timeouts as they get the stoppage with a little over 50 seconds to go in the first half. Here's Purdy on first and 10. He'll get this out wide here to McCaffrey. And yeah, that's good for a gain of six. And that'll bring up second down. Now another timeout called for by the offense as the clock's going to stop with 47 seconds to go in half number one. Here now, second and four. Purdy. He'll buy some time right. That's going to be caught by Samuel. Just a gain of a couple there. And now two yards to go on third down. Now a timeout called for by the offense as they stop it here with just under 40 ticks to go in this first half. Here we go. They'll come to the line needing only two yards to gain the first here. Purdy will look to throw again here. Work in the middle of the field and he's got a man complete. And he'll be brought down with a first down as the tackle's made at the Chiefs 37. And throwing here, Purdy. And that is incomplete. Well, it hasn't been a banner first half for the defense trying to cover him today, but they'll take that one right there, helping force that incompletion. Now a second and ten. They go play action here, Purdy. And he will find his man, Samuel. Touchdown! Debo Samuel in the final seconds of the first half. And the Niners are able to cut into this lead in the final seconds of the first half. That's one of the better examples of clock management I've seen. Whittled it all the way down just about and still put the ball in the end zone. Yeah, just a methodical drive and something really to take into the lockers here. Now Moody for the PAT. He's got it, and they're back within a touchdown at 28-21. 
four seconds. All that remain here in this first half as the kick gets away. And that one will bounce out of the back of the end zone, so we will start here at the 25. shot before the half from Mahomes and he'll be hit as he releases it and that'll fall incomplete and that'll do it for the end of the second quarter this is the NFL and it's on EA Sports welcome back halftime over we are ready for quarter number three alongside Charles Davis I'm Brandon Gordon both these offenses have been in fine form. What will the second half bring us as we are underway in quarter three? And we'll see a return here from the end zone. And he'll be brought down shy of the 20, so the decision to bring it out of the end zone, not a good one. The Chiefs offense about set to begin this drive. As this offense takes the field to begin the opening drive of the second half, Charles, remember that first half, good through the air and really all around an outstanding offensive performance. Absolutely. They reached the end zone several times. The passing game working awfully well and most importantly, partner. And yeah, they went to the tunnel with a lead. They come back out with that lead. Absolutely. NFL coaches, we know they're perfectionists in a lot of ways, but they had to like what they saw in that first half. So from the 36 now, first and 10. To throw, it's Mahomes. The 49ers get there. And now they're in the hurry up. Now Mahomes throwing on second down. It's Kelsey on the ground. And that was yardage that they needed there after the sack on first down. They didn't get all of it back. But now they look at third down as a manageable situation. One that they have a much better chance of picking up. He's going to flip that out to the flat. It's complete. And he will have a Chiefs first down. It won't be by much. He needed three, and he got three, barely. But the mark shows first down. And Mahomes sees something. He'll change the play. So they accept the penalty, of course, and push the offense backwards a bit. The false start backs him up five. First and 15. Now Mahomes, flush to his right. That ball is caught. Marquez Valdez-Scantling down the right sideline. And all the way in for a Kansas City touchdown. Marquez Valdez-Scantling, two catches, two touchdowns here so far as his guys are able to extend their lead. Extra point by Butker is on target. And the lead now up to 14. Now after the touchdown, here's Butker on to kick it away. And he'll get it up across the 20 to the 21-yard line. The 49er offense set to get this drive underway. And their deficit a little wider than it was at halftime. Does that touchdown a minute ago change the thinking here at all? I think it does, at least a little bit, because now urgency has to start setting in. You can't go out there and go three and out and run the risk of falling behind substantially, but you have to do it without pressing, because pressing, that leads you into bigger errors. And he slips up past the 45 before being tackled. And quickly, they get to the line. A handoff, McCaffrey running right. And he's fortunate to get anything from that. Give him a yard up to the 49. Now second and nine. Ayuk going to go in motion right. There's a fake on the jet sweep, and now off play action, it's Purdy. And he'll dump this off to his running back, McCaffrey. And he'll be out just a yard or two shy of the 30. 
The catch and run, good for 18 and a first down. Play action, and now here's Purdy to throw it. Able to find Gray here. And he gets this one inside the 15, just a yard or two shy of the 10. From down at the 12, it's first and 10. Purdy will set up to throw it here. And he's going to be dropped back at the 15-yard line. Looking to speed things up here, going with some tempo. Purdy now on second down. That is caught by the tight end, Kittle. Touchdown, 49ers. A 15-yard touchdown grab. And the Niners are able to cut into this deficit here in the final minute of the third. The extra point try now for Moody. And that'll cut the lead down now to a touchdown. So after the main field goal by Moody, he's back out to kick this one away. And they'll let that one go as it skips through the back of the end zone for a touchback. The KC offense out of the huddle, ready for their next drive. Still enjoying the lead here in the third quarter despite their defense giving up that last touchdown. Now they'll see if they can get the equalizer here on this drive. And now a throw on first down there, but it's incomplete. His back has been a dependable safety valve all game, so he went back to him when his first read was covered. Just unable to connect, so the play results in no gain. Third quarter of a tight football game as we come up on a second and ten. Here's Pacheco headed right. And he tried to bounce it outside, but they'll stop him behind the line. They're going to hurry back to the line now. They go play fake. Mahomes. Try to fight his tight end, Kelsey, and it's intercepted. Picked off by Fred Warner. And the Niners are going to get the football back as time will run out in this third quarter of play. So it'll be a change of possession on the turnover when we get back. This is the National Football League on EA Sports. A looming decision to make on the conversion down seven, but first things first, they need to score as they come up on first and goal. McCaffrey will get into the end zone for a 49 touchdown. We are set up for a fantastic finish now. A fourth quarter touchdown here. We're an extra point away from a tied football game. And I know they're thinking about possibly going for two, but I'd go ahead and kick this one and just get it back to level. Now Moody for the PAT. And no sweat. He puts it through, and we are tied here in the fourth. Now this one setting up for a great finish. All tied in the fourth as the kick's away. And a decent return out to the 27-yard line. The Chiefs offense about set to begin this drive. They no longer have the lead after that last touchdown. All tied up in the fourth quarter. And a chance for this offense to mount a potential game-winning drive right here. For the first play of the drive, lost four. Now they'll look to move it forward here on second and 14. Escaping the pressure right. Now on the run, he'll throw it back deep over the middle. And this is going to be intercepted. Put up by Talanoa Hufanga. And he'll take it across midfield to the 46-yard line. Purdy looking to throw on first down here. On a heavy rush, and down he goes. The Mississippi State man, Chris Jones, with a sack there. Got to assume this defense will be charging again here. It's second and 15. Purdy off the play fake. That ball caught. Brandon Ayuk. He'll get this one down near the 20-yard line. Just shy of the 20. A game there of 30 big ones. 
So the big play gets him all the way down to the outskirts of the red zone here for first and 10. Now a give right side McCaffrey. And he'll keep it moving down to the 15-yard line. 59 yards rushing for him now in the ball game. That play wasn't quite as big as the play that preceded it, but still, got to like the way they're moving the football, partner. Absolutely. Pretty good room to run on that last play. Yeah, they didn't get a first down, but still, you take runs like that each and every time, won't you? And the Niners are going to have a first and goal forthcoming as he takes this down to about the five-yard line. That's pretty much meat and potatoes right there, wasn't it? Just go right at them and let your big horse charge up the middle. Not too fancy there, was it? Nothing fancy at all, challenging that defense. And on that go-around, the offense won the challenge. Now they send a man in motion right. They'll try to run with McCaffrey. But a spotlight hit him once already tonight as he got into the end zone. He was trying to make it a double spotlight, wasn't he? But credit the defense, bottling him up, not letting him get in for the second score there. Getting down to the good stuff. All tied with two minutes remaining on EA Sports. And here's another kneel down as he'll try to set up the game winner. And quickly, we're going to get another stop here with 1.54 left as they call the timeout defensively. This is third and goal. On the ground, McCaffrey. And he'll take this into the end zone for a San Francisco touchdown. Christian McCaffrey with now two fourth quarter touchdowns. And the 49ers have broken this deadlock and have taken the lead here in the fourth. So here's Moody back out there now to send this one away. And he'll be tackled just shy of the 25. Here's first down. Mahomes. And ball caught. It's Rice. Now inside the 25. And all the way in for the Kansas City touchdown. Rasheed Rice. 76 yards. And the Chiefs are an extra point away from tying this game here in the final minutes. Don't forget the extra point. It's up and good. And we are tied here in the fourth quarter. Now this one setting up for a great finish. All tied in the fourth as the kick's away. And he'll be stopped up at the 25. The San Francisco offense ready to start their next drive. We have seen a lot of points here in this quarter. For us up here in the booth, it's been fun to watch. The defensive coordinators probably scratching their heads. Yeah, they're going a little bit crazy right now. But let's face it, all of our friends who play fantasy, <laughs> they're enjoying the heck out of this show because most of them are creating and getting a bunch of points. Uh, points certainly not in the premium here. And he's going to have a Niners first down as he's got this up to the 40-yard line. To throw his party. Right side, and he finds Gray. Now, loose football. The ball comes out, but it looks like one of the DBs has it. It's not often that we see big plays end in disaster, and we just absolutely saw it right there. They had something really big cooking on that one. Can you, when, you, when you're down near the goal line like that on a big play, do you get maybe a little too careless, a little too desperate for the goal line? I think the last part is exactly right. You get desperate for the goal line, and sometimes you get the ball out ahead away from your body, or you're trying to extend to get there, or maybe you're just trying so hard 
then the ball will come out of your hands. In any event, that's a big opportunity lost. Brandon's okay what they're doing right now. Still able to work the middle of the field, but you know sooner or later, they're going to have to stop the clock. Now another timeout called for by the offense as the clock stops with 23 seconds to go in the game. Here's second and a yard. Mahomes sliding out of the pocket. And he'll take this to the other side of midfield before going out of bounds. They're not out of it yet, but in order to come back, they need to play clean football the rest of the way. He makes the correct read there, passing on challenging a blanket coverage and getting the first down with his legs instead. Mahomes on the move to his left. Now he'll let it go on the run, deep left side. And that's going to be incomplete. Zone coverage there, and they were playing deep. That makes it obviously a little bit harder to run by guys. And that time, there's not much of a window to get the ball in there, and it winds up incomplete. Yellow, yellow. Mahomes. The pass complete on the crossing route. This is Tony with it. And now with six seconds remaining, they're going to burn their final timeout. Tell you what, he's been able to put the ball in some tight spots all game long. That throw, no different. Yeah, a lot of people would call it a gutsy type of a throw. I think he looks at it as, I can do it. So it's not that big of a deal to me. I'm going to keep firing. And his kick is good. And it's celebration time on that sideline as they have taken the lead in the final seconds. So they hadn't called on him at all until this point, but he comes through here and buries one from long range. Yeah, that's awfully impressive because usually kickers like to get that first one out of their system in the first quarter, sort of get them into the flow of the game, but to come in this late and knock it down from long distance, give him a lot of credit. Final two seconds. This is it. Purdy with one final shot here. He's going to let it fly. And this is dropped. Oh, it's incomplete. He had a big gainer in his sights, but he could not reel it in. Well, it took us until the final play, Charles, to officially decide a winner. Although on that last play, they were so backed up, it would have taken a miracle, and they couldn't get that miracle done. Well, I like how you stayed with it because we both knew that this had to go down to the last play, and neither side was going to exhale until that play concluded because we've seen the improbable before couple of laterals maybe some poor defense on the back end they might have gone all the way to the end zone in this case though it didn't happen perhaps next time so that'll do it for my partner charles davis and the best darn crew in the industry i'm brandon gaunt this has been a presentation of the nfl on ea sports with that we say good night from silicon valley